Hallelujah. See, we rule by words. So now with that understanding, can you turn to your neighbor, tell them, neighbor, from today, you will dine at the king's table. That's where God wants you to be. He's taking you back right there. So David restores Mephibosheth, a dead dog, to the king's table. And when he sits at the king's table, your position covers your condition. Mephibosheth was crippled in both feet. But when he sat at the king's table, no one could see the crippled feet. Everyone could see the upper part. And that's what God does. He says, forget the former things. For behold, I shall do a new thing. It shall sprout and everyone shall see it. It doesn't matter where you are. Lord, is just a place. But you are coming back to your original blueprint where you sit at the king's table and your position covers your condition. You may be in a mess, but I prophesy this evening that your position is about to cover your condition. I prophesy this afternoon, wherever the devil put you, I call you back to your original ordination. Come back to your place. Come back to your place. Whatever God God ordained for you. I'm calling you back to that place. Come back to the priesthood. Come back to the kingship. Come back to the prophetic. Come back to the place that Jesus ordained for you. I don't know where life placed you, but I sense in my spirit the glory of the Lord is upon you. For he has anointed you to proclaim liberty to the captives. To pronounce the acceptable year. I pray for you. Whatever comes your way, nothing will shake you. Nothing will mess you up. You have been ordained by God. You have been pre-approved to sit at the king's table. Someone